What's up everybody, this is Blockus, and today I'll be showing you how to build a simple skulk sensor activity detector using command blocks. Now let's get you the stuff you need. And if you don't know how to get a command block, go ahead and click the link in the description to the tutorial that I made on this topic. Now let's go ahead and get started. First you're going to place two blocks, and then you're going to place a command block right after them. And then next you're going to count two empty blocks and place a command block on the third block. Now place a repeater going into the second command block and set it to 4 ticks. And then place a repeater going out the side from the empty spot. Now we're going to place the skulk sensor on the first block we placed and then a comparator sticking out of it and then a piece of redstone dust right above the command block. And now we're done with the basic structure. Next we're going to place a placeholder block in the middle and then we're going to type forward slash set block space and then tab three times and then space redstone underscore block. Then we're going to select everything and copy it. Then we're going to hit the enter button and we'll see a redstone block appear right here. Now we're going to right click the first command block and type execute space if block tilde tilde1 tilde to check the block right above the command block. And we'll check if there is redstone wire, open square brackets and type power equals 1 to detect walking. Next we're going to say run and we're going to paste the command that we have copied earlier and then we're just going to remove the forward slash at the beginning and this command block will be done. Next we're going to click the second command block and then we're going to type the same command or we're going to paste it since we copied it earlier and then we're going to change the words redstone block to air. And now the entire contraption is completed. So as you see if I start walking a redstone block is going to momentarily appear and disappear, sending a signal. But if I jump from high up, it's not going to do anything even though the skulk sensor knows that I did something. And if I throw something at the skulk sensor, once I get it right, you'll see that even though it knows I threw something, it doesn't produce a signal, and it only produces it if I start walking. And if you want to detect any other kind of activity, just refer to the chart that I have in my description as well as the official wiki link. And if you've enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.